no plans at the moment, but that could change in the future The launch of the redesigned 2019 Acura RDX marks an important time in Acura's business Honda's performance brand has been on the right side of business recently, and the introduction of the new RDX gives the automaker another model to offer to the public should the RDX become a success, it could convince Acura to beef up its lineup with a smaller, subcompact SUV. That may be a possibility in the future, but for the moment, don't expect to see one, at least according to Acura of Division General Manager John Akita. The Acura way, maintaining balance Acura's focus is putting out the best product possible, one that can live up to the brand's status as a performance automaker. As surprising as it is to hear an automaker dismiss the possibility of having more crossovers and SUVs in its lineup, Acura's position makes some sense. According to John Akita, volume is less of a priority for the company these days than focusing on its core models. That's what the company wants to elevate. We have to have a balanced portfolio, Akita said. There are still cars on the road. Balance is a good place to be. Akita added that not everyone has to swim with the current, particularly in the increasingly popular crossover and SUV segments. If there's a possibility that a smaller RDX will impede another Acura model from blossoming on its own, the company would rather let that model reach its potential than undermining it with another model that occupies the same market. Anything else that can be interpreted as a bigger, smaller version of the SUV isn't on the table at the moment. So instead of worrying about what models to add to its lineup, Acura's focus is putting out the best product possible, one that can live up to the brand's status as a performance automaker. We're a performance brand, so no matter where the market goes, our cars better drive like stink, Akita said. If it's about trucks, we'll have the best, most fun to drive trucks. Based on the initial reception surrounding it, the new RDX appears to fit into what Acura is trying to establish. It is improved looks, an upgraded interior, a sharper suspension design, and a 2.0-liter turbo engine that produces an impressive 272 horsepower. It also features Acura's super-handling all-wheel drive system, which should make it a lot of fun to drive. Putting all of this together on the RDX is what the company is striving for. Anything else that can be interpreted as a bigger, smaller version of the SUV isn't on the table at the moment. It could still happen in the future, but for now, all of it appears to be just noise.